How much of this is a play on pharmaceutical, but how much of it is really a play on the U.S. market? How will it bolster your exposure to the U.S.? Well, we are already very strong in U.S. in different sectors of the industry, especially aerospace, uh, mobility, on even um, life science equipment on high tech. Uh, but this, this, of course, is uh, provided that there are large pharma players in U.S. on a powerful ecosystem uh, for personalized health. This will accelerate our U.S. business, but it's really also acceleration worldwide. But so what will the system actually look like in five, ten years? I mean, primarily you're known for defense. You are, of course, also known for your life and science unit. But with this acquisition, does it mean that investors should look for more diversity or actually just a change into pharmaceuticals and life and science? Uh, the diversification has uh, already started. 30% of our the Dassault system revenue out of uh, almost $4 billion. Uh, 30%, 32% is coming from new industries uh, such as uh, life science, uh, uh, c uh, consumer goods, uh, or, or high tech. And uh, our um, dynamic to expand the digital transformation platform for research, development, manufacturing, clinical trial in healthcare is so needed uh, because uh, I think this sector has to apply what aerospace applied to uh, master uh, their um, reliability and performance and it's needed in the healthcare. That's the reason of the MIDI data acquisition. So do you believe that actually there's anything else that you would like to buy in that space? Do you want to grow even bigger in healthcare? Um, healthcare is, in terms of total accessible market, as big as, big as what is uh, the uh, basically uh, the, the manufacturing sector. So uh, we have already entered with uh, the acquisition of Acceleris, now called Biovia, for research on uh, what we call One Lab. Uh, on expanding with clinical trial is a logical step to have a digital continuity for, from our research to basically uh, product on the market and commercialization. Uh, I'm sure that probably there will be other spotted uh, needed technology, but for the time being, I think it's a game changer uh, alliance with the two platforms, big data for trial and analytics on modeling and simulation on our side. Uh, this is unique, and, and no one else can provide it. Uh, Mr. Charles, how much do you worry about uh, trade concerns? Day in, day out, we talk about the U.S.-China spat. Day in, day out, we talk about a, a possible recessionary environment for some of the top economies in the world. How does that actually play into your thinking on how you know, diversified and how global you want to be? Uh, we in the in the industries we serve uh, aerospace and defense mobility uh, high tech on CPG we are already very global. Uh, it's clear that this concern about the the, 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 the trade uh, dispute is, is is really generating some concerns. But I don't think this in any way is slowing down the enterprise uh, dynamic for innovation and to find out new solutions for the sectors they serve. So, uh, yes, it's a concern in terms of complexity of the business, but it's not, we believe, when it comes to us, a concern in terms of uh, growth dynamic.